Can I be honest here? As an online course creator, I have a dream. A dream that there is one piece of software out there, one platform, one tool that can do it all. Deep down, I know that that might be asking a little bit much. And what I want this online platform to have is the ability to sell digital products, to sell online courses, to allow me to have a membership site, to allow me to have affiliate partners that can promote and sell my courses that they believe in, to allow me to be able to take payments and receive payments just like that, and to be super mobile responsive, beautifully designed with a clean interface that is simple as heck to use and is affordable. But, you know, dreams are free. That is until I came across Podia. And I must admit, I'm just a little bit excited. I don't quite know how I missed this tool before. I definitely heard of it. Um, over the years, I have researched a plethora, a plethora, I love that word, of online platforms. And there are so many great ones out there. There are more and more being made every day because the online e-learning industry is booming and it's not going anywhere anytime soon. To put it in perspective, it is going to triple by 2025 and be a $325 billion industry. I can't even really put that in perspective, but let's just say that's a shit ton. And if you are not part of that revolution, if you are not part of our ability as humans to always want to be learning and growing and improving, if you are not either learning yourself or out there teaching others what you know so that they can learn from you, then you're missing out. I don't know how else to put it. When people come to me and say, but what skills and knowledge and experience do I have that people care about? I'm like, let me name a million because every single experience you've ever had in your life, anything you've ever been taught, anything you've ever learnt, implemented, actioned, experienced for yourself is highly likely that somebody else wants to learn that. And you need to step up and be a teacher and share that with other people. You need to be able to add value to their life, to give generously, and to teach. And you also need to be able to learn, continue to upskill, reskill, and all those good things. But I digress. Let's come back to the online learning industry. In order to survive in the future of work and actually thrive, we need to be constantly learning. We need to become lifelong learners. Otherwise, we're going to get left behind and the robots are actually going to come in and replace us. So that is why the e-learning industry is growing at a speed of light, because so many people realize how important it is to stay relevant, to continually stretch themselves and push themselves and challenge themselves by learning. And that means there need to be a whole heap of online course creators out there and teachers who are willing to bring you up to speed. I like to think of this as being a leading learner. You're not an expert, you're not a guru, you're just a couple of steps ahead of the person who is right behind you and wanting to come up to speed really quickly. And so as an online course creator, when I find a platform that allows me to do that in lots of different ways, because I don't believe that just courses is the way, I don't believe that just digital products are the way, and I don't believe that things like memberships and communities are the way by themselves, but combined, they make an incredible learning experience. So when I found that Podia does all of those in one tool, I was just a little bit excited. And so I asked them to do a demo for me before I jumped in to try them. And since that demo, I have switched. I am using it. You will be experiencing it if you come along and join my Launch Your Damn Course Accelerator. Uh, but even if you don't and you've been looking for a platform that does all those things and that is super easy to use and affordable and is made by people who get the online course space and how to be a great educator and help people learn rather than 90% of people who take courses and never finish, a statistic that really pains me. Basically, we all need to be creating better course experiences. But I digress. If you have been looking for this, then please watch the demo that's about to start. Thanks to Len Markman, who's there at Podia, who is doing these demos because he truly believes Podia have something going on, man. They are doing all the right things. And if you like the look of the software, there's a little link below this video where they are giving a little special extra to people in my community if you decide to take on a free trial and try it out for yourself. So enjoy the demo and be amazed as I was at all the things that they have going on. But 
that aren't overwhelming. They're just the things that you really, really, really want as an online course creator, as an online content creator, as an online business owner. This is the way you're going to get paid to be you and to be able to develop multiple revenue streams while making a massive impact. So enjoy. So a lot of demos start with people asking, I wanted to see Podia. Is it an online course platform? Is it a membership platform? Is it an email marketing platform? Is it a visual downloads platform? Because people kind of come from all over the internet where they've heard different things about Podia. And this is the part where I explain how it's all of those things. The entire idea behind Podia is that it's all in one, is that we're replacing for many creators, three, four, five, six different tools all at once. And I'll show you exactly how that works. But first I'll give you a couple of examples because one of the first things people always wanna see is does it look good? Like, can it actually look nice? Other people come from platforms where they're not really happy with the, the, the customizations or the landing pages and all those things. So I wanna show you some of those first, just to give you some examples. So this is an example of a Podia storefront. This is our own mm -hmm. Podia storefront. And you can see how all of the different types of products that we would sell or give away live in one place. So this is a digital download. This is an online course, another download. And then we have a membership community down here cool. and it's all, uh, all in one place. And you can get pretty sophisticated with the customizations on these. And I'll show you an example. So this is one of my favorite Podia landing pages. This is the Swiss Innovation Academy mm. and they've built, I mean, we have 13 different types of, of uh, content blocks that you can put on our sales pages and storefronts. And you see, you can create logo sections, testimonial sections, mm. text and images. You can embed videos directly into the, uh, into the landing page. Um, really go as long form or short form as, even, as you like. Nice. We have these category pages that you can create. So if you wanted to put all of your courses in one place, all of your downloads in one place, all of your eBooks in one place, um, you can do that. The other use case for this is that we have a lot of creators who might sell to two different audiences. So maybe you sell to school teachers as well as school administrators, but they're two totally different types of customers. They'll have two totally different types of products that they'll be interested in. And so you can use categories to uh, separate them that way. Mm. Nice. Yeah. That looks and I like it. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's an, uh, this is just one more. So this is uh, the Ojoy storefront. So you can get really, cool. you can get really flexible and customizable with how you, how you make these look. Um, I'm, I think personally, this was one of my favorite things about Podia is the fact that you can, you don't really need landing page software. You don't need to use, you know, a lead pages or an unbounce like a lot of people do to, uh, have a really great looking landing page for your courses, for your, for your, uh, for your sales pages, for your storefront, everything is, uh, is in one place. And we also recently launched the ability to create, uh, custom pages. Mm -hmm. So you can actually use your Podia storefront as your website. You can create about pages, uh, contact pages, bio pages, anything that you want. Uh, and you get unlimited pages with your, uh, with your account. We don't charge anything extra for that. Nice. Um, so we're just trying to streamline the experience as much as possible. And now I on, see, yeah. I just was going to say, I see at the top, you've got like store.swissinnovation.academy and I think joy had academy.ojoy.com. So there's options there to have, a direct URL that you can customize, I assume. Yep, yeah. absolutely. You can bring your custom domain over. So you can see ours is on store.podia.com. And when you sign up for Podia, you'll get a podia.com subdomain included in your account. Okay. Um, so it can be um, natalie.podia.com if that's available um, or whatever you wanted it to be. Mm -hmm. But you can also absolutely bring a custom domain over and you can use that at, at no extra charge as well. Okay, cool. Yeah. Then on the back end of, uh, of Podia, you can see we also just tried to keep things very, very streamlined and simple and, and clean. And I'll show you some of the features. So this, this is um, where you would do your custom domain like you were just asking about. Mm -hmm. You can add uh, Google Analytics. You can add any custom code that you want in terms, you know, third-party things. A lot of people will use uh, like Facebook Pixel to run ads or AdWords Pixel, or some people will integrate tools like uh, live chat or deadline funnel for those countdown timers. Um, I mean, you, you know all the tools better than I do. So there's a million different things you can, uh, you can add uh, with that, uh, with a third party snippet. We have, uh, I think 11 languages that we're supporting now awesome. as well as, uh, yeah, as well as 22 different currencies, mm. including 
Australian dollars, Canadian dollars, um, euros, uh, all sorts of different currencies for our EU customers. We have VAT collection, uh, so we make that really easy and just give you all your reporting at the end of the year. And you can connect your Stripe or PayPal accounts directly. Now that seems like a mundane feature, but this is actually one big differentiator to many platforms because connecting your payment platform directly means a few things. Number one, Podia takes no transaction fees. Uh, we take zero transaction fees. Stripe or PayPal will charge you their, their usually 2.9% plus 30 cents per transaction, depending on what country you're in. But we don't take anything off the top. And even more importantly for a lot of our creators, it also means that you're getting paid instantly. You're getting paid the minute somebody purchases your product, that money goes into your Stripe or your PayPal account right away. Uh, we're not holding on to your money for 15 days, 30 days. Uh, we're not issuing refunds on your behalf. You own the transaction, you own the relationship with the customer, uh, and we're not going to be getting in the middle of that. That is fantastic to hear. I really like that. Excellent. Um, then I'll show you, I'll actually, Back in Mainly settings. because I have to say, I just noticed that um, platform I am currently using withhold it for um, 30 to 60 days. And I was like, oh, that's weird because it used to be paid out all the time. And it is quite frustrating when you're waiting on, it's just when you're waiting on payments and you just don't get them. It just throws you a little bit when you're looking at your accounting for the month. So it can definitely be frustrating, especially in a business where cash flow is really important. Like yeah. being an entrepreneur is, is yeah. it's always <laughs> cash flow is always important. Um, and, and, you know, there are a lot of different reasons platforms do that. Some do it. I mean, a lot of them will say they do it in case people want refunds, but the reality is if somebody's holding on to your money, they're probably making money off of it. Yeah. Uh, and we, uh, yeah, we, we're not in that game. Yeah. Uh, Good to then, hear. <laughs> yeah. On the, uh, on the product side, so you have your uh, online courses, you have your digital downloads. You can also create uh, bundles. So if you wanted to bundle together oh, different cool. products, and you can sell that as one thing. Uh, and you have a very sort of simple little uh, editor here. I'll actually go into one of our actual courses. So we have this 10-step product bootcamp and you can add sections of any kind. You can add uh, text uh, content. You can add video content. Again, all the video hosting is included. It's unlimited. There's no bandwidth limitations or anything like that. Uh, you can add quizzes. Uh, we can add file downloads of any kind. So PDFs, eBooks, um, any, anything you'd like there. This is all, uh, you know, drag and drop. You can move content around. Uh, very, very kind of simple and familiar text editor, rich text editor to anybody that's used um, anything like that. Nice. Very good. And yeah, thank you. This is, uh, this is all thanks to our, uh, designers. Um, they are far more talented at this than I, uh, than I am. If I, if I designed this, it would look very different, which is why they don't, <laughs> is why they don't let me touch any of the designing. Uh, we also have, uh, this previewable feature, which I'm a big fan of. So this is, if you click on this little eyeball here, what'll happen is this section will be something that on your sales page, people will be able to watch. So they'll be, you'll be able, they'll be able to get a taste of your course of your content. And a lot of our creators actually use this as an opportunity to create a sales video in their course viewer. So I'll show you what that looks like. So this here is uh, Justin Jackson's course marketing for developers. And on his sales page, he actually has a few pieces of content set up as previewable. So if I click on this as a, as a prospect, it'll open up the course viewer and I will feel like I'm in the course, I'll get a taste of being in Justin's course and I can watch this introduction video and, uh, you know, get, uh, get sold on the product. Gotcha. Nice. I like it. It's really clean. I like the left-hand side type of contents and just the whole whiteness of it looks really good. The other neat thing about this, I'm glad you brought it up. So this is all going to look really good on tablet and mobile as well. Mm -hmm. So these courses will all be consumed on, on cell phones, on tablets, um, any device at all. Uh, it can all be taken on the go and it still looks really clean, really simple. Yeah. And this is another example of a course. So this is Val Geisler's course and I'm actually a student in this course. I love her content. Um, and as I go through the course, the sections here will get grayed out and crossed out as I've completed them. And I can track my progress and if I log out and come back in, it'll still show me where I am. And as an instructor, I can also track my students' progress, see where they are, make sure that they're actually going through, uh, make sure they're actually going through the course, which 
is something we actually, you, know, you and I spoke about in, on, on the podcast, which was mm-hmm. you know, course completion rates being so, being so challenging. Uh, and that's uh, getting those kinds of insights can help you build better content, can help you try different things to encourage your students to move along and, and, and make progress in the course. Yeah. Do you have any gamification included around, hey, congrats, you completed the first lesson or module one or anything um, at this point, or is that in development? That is in the works. Okay. Uh, that's, I'm glad you asked. So we don't have that right now, but that is something that is very actively being worked on. Perfect. Yeah. Then on the course side, you also have a few options uh, around uh, setting up the course. Some of the things I really like, um, probably my favorite feature that we've released this year has been this ability to create a start date that's in the future. That again, sounds very simple, but there are a few reasons why I love this feature. The first is it creates accountability. How many of us say we're going to start a course and then we kick the can down the road for months and months and months. Uh, And so what this feature allows you to do is actually launch your course, take payment for it, but set a start date, say two months from today. And so people will start paying you for the course and you're essentially running a Kickstarter for your course. You're getting paid to build your course. Um, So it takes the risk. Yeah, exactly. Pre-selling. It takes the risk out of the process and it also creates a certainty because if if people are paying you for the course, of course you're going to buckle down and actually create it. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. This is also, and this is also really powerful too for, for um, creators who want to have all, who want to have students uh, take the course in cohorts. So if you want a live component to your course um, and you want to make sure everybody's going through it at the same time and getting the content dripped out at the same exact time, um, this would be the feature that you would, uh, that you would use. Perfect. Yeah. Mm -hmm. On the, pricing side. So we also have opportunities for, you can create payment plans. Um, if you, know, you don't want to sell your course for $200, you can sell it for $200 or three payments of $79 or whatever pricing plans you wanted there. Mm-hmm. Also have built-in upsells. Ooh, so if you I have, can. yeah. And what's really cool. So there are a couple of really interesting things we've released with upsells recently. So you can upsell into, because it's Podia is all in one, you can upsell into different product types. So mm-hmm. if somebody purchases your course, you can also upsell them into your membership pro- program. Mm. So, so a great way to bundle, hey, you're going to take my course. That's great. We're going to get all this value. Would you also like a discount on this membership program where we can work together on the lo- you know, in the long term to steward these ideas you're going to learn and make sure that you have the support, um, you know, mm-hmm. ongoing support. Love it. Yeah. And you can also now upsell off of free products. So if you have a digital mm-hmm. download that you're offering as just a lead magnet, um, that's a, a good opportunity where you could potentially upsell somebody to you know, a, a low cost ebook or something like that. Ooh. Now yeah. you got me thinking. <laughs> yeah. That's, I, I love these features too. When I play around with these, I'm like, Oh, I could, I could do something with this. So for example, that would be a landing page for my get paid to be you audio book, uh, sorry, audio and guidebook um, could be hosted on Podia so they could opt in to get it there. And as they're opting in, I could offer an upsell to, for example, a get paid to be you mini course. Exactly. Okay. Yep. That's not on what, what you create doing that course then. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and then on the, you know, everybody likes coupons. You have uh, a few options for coupons here. You can create your uh, time limited coupons. You can create usage limited coupons. Um, we also have a neat little option. So one of the things that uh, a lot of our course creators were telling us was uh, that they kept getting emails from people that didn't, uh, you know, didn't, they thought they wanted the discount, but they, they say they put in their coupon code, but they never got the discount. And now they're, now that the creator has to go back and do all this bookkeeping. And so what we, uh, what we have here is you can just create a URL that contains the coupon in it. And so when somebody goes to the, uh, when somebody goes to this URL, the coupon will already be applied on the landing page and they will see the discount on the, uh, on the landing page here. And this is already a free product, so it's no discount, but um, they would see the discount directly on the uh, sales page for the product. Perfect. And I assume you could also use that URL direct off your own landing page. So if you were building it on your website and you were like enroll here, that URL could be on the button that person clicks and it takes them straight to the checkout page. Yes, absolutely. And I am so thrilled that you asked that question because it gives me the opportunity to share what, I think I've said favorite a couple of times, but this is actually my favorite Podia feature. Okay, uh, I believe you. <laughs> yeah. So this is our embeddable buy buttons. 
And you can send people to your Podia page and have them purchase there. However, you can also sell Podia products or give away Podia downloads from any page on the internet. Ooh, and like the way that this works is there are, there are platforms that have embed buttons and what they do is they redirect people to your landing pages on their platform. So Podia's uh, embeds will actually launch the checkout window on any page on the internet. So on your WordPress blog, on your lead pages page, on your, you know, any, anything that, uh, anything that you have, you can launch the checkout window um, right on the page. So your visitors, your customers can buy without ever leaving the page. That's freaking cool. Even in an email. Yeah. Even in an email. Exactly. I like that. And you can, uh, you can just use simple, uh, Mm. buttons like this you can create rich product cards like this that'll have images and um, and, and descriptions you can even do it with just text nice. so you can you can add a little uh, add a little code to uh to your hyperlink and you can create the checkout window right there and so if that was a paid course it would have by now the payment um all the payment options and then enter in a few details exactly so here's what the, that would look like uh, let's go to an actual paid course and Let's buy it for 150 and gotcha. Perfect. Oh, this. That's really cool. Yeah, and then it'll ask me for my email. So I don't usually just go into people's uh, courses and fake buy them, but we know Danielle and he knows that we do this. Okay. Uh, <laughs> You'll be like, <laughs> we'll do another sale. Damn it. Exactly. Just yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, I really and, like that interface. It's very clean and simple. Yeah. It's, yeah, so it's, it's something we call it our 12 second checkout because that's how long it takes if people have their credit card information saved. Um, we, a lot of, uh, I'm sure you've been through those checkout processes where they ask you for your billing address, your password, like set up your whole account before you can even pay, which adds so much friction to the buying process. Mm -hmm. um, so we take all of that out of the process. We essentially just ask for email in mm -hmm. the first screen because then you capture the email and then you can you know, yep. do abandoned card emails and things like that. Um, and then just the credit card number and we, we charge them the expiration and we charge the credit card and then they get taken to the screen to set their password and to the billing address, all of those details. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. So you've got less or fewer people hopefully pulling out at that point because they're frustrated by the enrollment process. Uh, exactly. A lot less friction and a lot less abandonment. And I assume that's also then linked to them now being um, in the email system for that particular course. So you can send email updates or integrate it with um, your own email provider. Absolutely. Yep. So cool. there'll be this, uh, so Podia has its own built-in email marketing system and you can send drip campaigns, you can send newsletters. Um, we're actually doing a lot of work on this platform right now as well. Um, so we're going to be releasing some really cool new features here, um, but you can trigger campaign, uh, you can trigger email campaigns to get sent based on the products that people buy. Uh, so if you're looking for uh, a simple email platform that is just used to kind of build your, build your online product funnel. Podia can essentially accomplish that for almost any creator. Um, and you'll never get those emails that many of us who have had email service providers often get that say something like, congratulations, your subscriber count has grown. Your new uh, monthly bill is this and it's a hundred dollars more. Yeah. Um, so if you want to keep things simple, absolutely. Um, you can use the Podia email platform. Cool. And we also, if you prefer to use your own email service provider, I know many of us have ones that we love. We have direct integrations with ConvertKit, MailChimp, Drip, Aweber, ActiveCampaign, GetResponse, MailerLite. Nice. And, so most of yeah. all of them. And then Zapier for ones that aren't included. Love it. Exactly. Zapier for everything that has slipped through the cracks. Perfect. Oh, awesome. I also really like that on the email front because um, that's all built into your price, isn't it? It's all built in one flat fee. There's no scale, sliding scale pricing. Everything is included. Nice. Yeah. And then just a couple quick more features that I'll show you and then I'll, and then I'll uh, yes. go through the pricing. Ooh, with I was you hoping you'd click on affiliates. I'm pretty excited about this because I think, yes. yeah, I'm just, I'm keen to see what you have to say about it. Oh, it's a proper dashboard of affiliate settings. One of my biggest bugbears is course provider platforms that don't provide this, or if they have it, it's pretty lightweight, or you have to do a bit of a workaround to find the unique code for the person who wants to promote your course, and then the URL for the course, and stitch it together. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to show me this. <laughs> yeah, this is this is something that a lot of our creators before 
before they used Podia were, were essentially stitching together an affiliate program with duct tape or using like a third party shopping cart like SamCart or something because it wouldn't work because they wouldn't be able to stitch it together with their, with their course platform. Um, so we launched the affiliate program. We've been doing a lot of work to it this year and we've launched a lot of really cool things. So you can set essentially affiliate, um, you can have affiliates that are your students. You can have affiliates that are outside of your program. Um, you can create unique commission amounts for any product. You can create unique commission amounts for any affiliate. Um, you can run you know, time limited campaigns on the affiliate side uh, and essentially just create a, a very customized uh, affiliate program uh, for any of your products on Podia. And the cool thing is because all of your products are in one place, you don't have to have three different affiliate programs and track all of your affiliates in three different places. Any affiliate can sell any of your products that you allow them to, and it all gets tracked in one place. Love it. Uh, and cool. yeah. And then the last, uh, last piece, not least I save, save one of the best for last is uh, the memberships platform. So I've talked about, courses, bundles, downloads, email marketing, and membership for me is one of the things that really ties it all together because courses are fantastic. They're, they're a really fantastic way to grow a digital product business. Uh, but what I really love about memberships is that unlike courses, they create recurring revenue because invariably you'll have students that finish your courses. They've gotten a lot of value out of them and they would be happy to continue their business relationship with you to continue getting value from you and continue paying you for it if only they had a way. And memberships are a fantastic way to do that. So you can, our membership platform lets you create uh, membership posts, you can embed videos, you can um, embed uh, social media posts, anything that you'd like there. And you can create unlimited membership plans. And when you create a plan, you can make it free, you can make it paid, but this is where the all-in-one aspect really ties in beautifully is with a single click, you can add access to any of your products, any of your downloads, any of your courses or your bundles uh, to members of that, uh, to members on that plan. Oh, that's cool. So for yeah. example, rather than, so they could be going to buy a course and one of the upsells could be, hey, actually join our membership community and you'll get access to these other two courses as well for you know the rest of the 12 months or whatever. Spoken like a course master. Yes, that's absolutely, uh, that is absolutely a fantastic uh, use case for, for upsells. Yes. Um, you can totally do that. A lot of what some of our creators do is, is use, is also use um, membership, a membership upsell as kind of, um, kind of like an Apple care uh, subscription where you buy my course and with a membership, you'll get essentially indefinite support um for uh for everything that you try to implement in the course yeah i really like that that's cool yeah and there are a couple different things that you can do here so you can also you can create um membership posts that are uh that are visible to specific uh specific membership plans mm -hmm. you can also connect um facebook group a slack community uh palapa which is a new uh new community um community software from uh, from the makers of fizzle uh yeah. Yeah, they, uh, they did a really neat job with it. Um, so some people will use Podia, uh, po the, po the Podia membership feature simply as a way to charge for a Facebook group or a Slack URL because hmm. you can just hide the, the sign-up links behind there. Yeah. And one thing that we launched this year that I've been very, very excited about has been the ability to not just create membership posts that your plan members can see, but when you create a membership post, you can actually set it so that it is uh, available publicly. Mm. So anybody on the internet can see your membership and then can see your membership post. So we have creators that are essentially using this as a blog and people will come to these articles. They'll see, hey, this is really great content. And then they'll see other content that's gated, that's behind a paywall. And they'll say, okay, well, if this is so good, then why wouldn't I just subscribe and pay for, uh, pay for the premium membership? Got it. And then there'd be a button that you can custom embed, um, which says join the community. Exactly. And this, this is what the, that looks like here. So if I go into the, uh, the community here, I can see the public posts. Oh, cool. And then when I get, get into the uh, private posts, I'll have to subscribe to unlock. Hmm. 
and I can subscribe and I can get access here and I'll see all my, all my different plan options here. Okay. Perfect. That's really yeah. good. Nice. Very clean, yeah. clean interface. Liking that. Yeah. I have to keep, I keep, I have to keep thanking the designers after every demo. Mm. <laughs> they're my kind of designers. <laughs> yeah. They're my kind of designers too. Um, and then that, um, that brings us to the pricing because this is probably the most surprising part for a lot of people. Because when I start talking about Podia replacing three or four or five different tools, people start, mm -hmm. people think, oh, this is going to cost what three or four or five different tools cost. But the reality is it's actually very, very affordable. We're um, very close to the bottom of the market for pricing. And we try to make it as easy as possible for people to launch their businesses. So we just have two plans, $39 a month and $79 a month. 39 will get you courses, downloads, email marketing. We don't charge those transaction fees. There's no limits on anything. Uh, and then the 24 hour seven support, we have live chat support in this purple window right here, nice. uh, as, well, as well as email support, of course. But most, for, mo most people who want support want it right then and there. And that's why we have live chat support staffed. Um, and then the 79 a month plan gets you those memberships that I showed you. They get you those embedded uh, checkout boxes affiliate marketing, you can add third party code like Facebook pixel and that kind of stuff. Um, and we also have free migration here. Ooh. So if you sign up for, uh, for Shaker, uh, you will get uh, all of your content, all of your students migrated over to Podia for free. We'll do all of the heavy lifting. You just tell us where everything is and our team will go get it, set it up for you. It usually takes less than 48 hours. Wow. Okay, nice. So if you're on another course platform, even if you've got tons of courses, you guys will... Yeah shake move and shake and move them over that's really that's really awesome and set them up so they look the same and probably even go this could be better <laughs> yeah, exactly we uh, we have some very finicky uh, course migrators who are very very keen on on making making uh, every creator's first impression when they see their storefront uh, a positive one uh, right. but yeah as many courses as you have as many digital downloads or as, as many products as you have maybe you'll beat our record um our uh, migration team one time migrated a storefront that had I think it was 320 uh, wow. downloads. Wow. Uh, it was somebody that had, uh, he had 60 or 70 eBooks. Then he had the same eBooks translated into four or five languages. Wow. Uh, but we did, did it for, that for that. Wow. Yeah. Okay. That is very generous. Um, and one thing I will say, just having worked with a lot of tools and platforms over the year, I was actually surprised at the, pi at the pricing because I think I paid it for my current provider. Um, and then on top of that, I often will pay or have paid for in the past an affiliate management system, um, a different membership system. Yeah, there's just a bunch of other costs that, as you said, you bring into one with Podia. So glad I found yeah. you. Yeah. I, appreciate, I appreciate you saying that so nicely too, because when I, so I demoed Podia for, uh, for Joanna Weeb of Copy Hackers. Mm -hmm. And after, at the end of the demo, I showed her the price and she went silent for it felt like a long time it was probably a few seconds and she just said why aren't you charging more <laughs> yeah. yeah why aren't you charging more i mean you just got a kick-ass team and you've managed to develop this and and do really well from it and that's what you want to be competitive and get lots of people we want to be competitive we want to get lots of people we want to make it as easy as possible for people to get started mm -hmm. and we just we really want podia to be a no-brainer for everybody that wants to think about making online courses Perfect. Well, yeah, I'm switching. And I will just say actually that I bought a piece of software earlier this year, which was just a checkout piece of software mm -hmm. that cost as much as your annual fee for the shake plan. And I actually ended up getting a refund for it. because so I was like, why, why have I just paid all this money for one thing that does one thing? It does it well. It does nice checkout and upsells, but it was nothing else to go with it. And I was like, no, that's just not a good use of my money. And then right. I see I can do all of it here. So and you'd probably have to use Zapier or some other things to figure, to get all of your other tools to talk to each other. WordPress and everything. So yeah, it was, um, yeah, I'm really glad I refunded that. <laughs> awesome. Thank you. Thank you for the demo too. Um, of course. Yeah. yeah, this is great. And I love that. I really actually, the, probably the main feature that I really like is how it looks on a landing page with all your courses. So currently my shop um, is a bit it's just not great. And so it'd be really nice to be able to put the free stuff in there, um, the courses, even digital downloads and memberships and have it as the landing page where people can, you know, buy your offers. Um, and also that you can categorize it so you can, you can almost use it as, as you said, a website as well as a blog. So all just all that functionality. If people didn't even have a website could just go through Podia. Yeah. Yeah. And we have one of the, one of the common questions that we get in our, we do, we do weekly demos. And one of the common questions that we get at the end of it is 
So I don't understand why do I, why do I need my Squarespace site? Why, why do I need my, why my site? Because you're right. If, if you, if you don't have a very content heavy site, um, there's no reason. And if you don't have, if you don't have a site at all and you're just starting out, there's, there's really no reason you would need one, especially now that we have custom pages. Yeah. I mean, like if you're an Instagram influencer or you just live on Facebook, you can just send people off to this and this is more than you need. So perfect. Absolutely. Awesome. Thank you, Lynn. Of course. It's my pleasure. Um, any questions or anything, uh, anything I can answer for you? I think uh, there was one just around the membership site. So from what I could see in there, you can create it, you can create posts, people can comment on that. Um, is there a community piece where people, it, it looks quite simple, which I really like. So is there a place where members can chat to members or is that where you would take people off to a Telegram group, a Slack group, a Facebook group? That's where you would connect a third party. So the, the Podium membership is more designed as rather than a many to many community, it's a one to many platform for a creator. Um, the, the idea is that we're selling recurring access to you. However, um, we have gotten a lot of requests for more forum style features. And while I'm not sure we'll ever actually have a, a proper forum, um, it doesn't really fit with what we're trying to build with the, with the memberships. We are building more engagement features, more community engagement features. So um, you will see, uh, probably early next year, some features that we'll be launching that will do what you, what you just suggested and, and make it possible for members to talk to each other. Perfect. Yeah. I'm actually not a huge fan of forums. They often aren't run super well or they're a little bit of a ghost town unless they're a really engaged community. Um, so I like that you can sort of choose the one that you want to use yourself to take people off to and, and different forms of messaging. But this reminds me of probably my very, very first course. I did something similar, but I set it up on a private, um, page on my website where you just enter in a code and it was literally just the videos from each coaching call each month um, embedded there and this is this but in a much nicer way and probably easier to engage with and I assume if they've enrolled in a course or downloaded a digital product that same login if they've joined the membership or if it's free will get them into the membership so they'll be able to see that when they log in. Absolutely and when I go to my uh, my dashboard as, as a student so I'm going to see any other products that it's very, very easy because my credit card information is saved. So with a, with a couple of clicks, I can enroll in any other courses or memberships or downloads that this creator wanted to make available to me. You can certainly hide things um, and then your students won't see them. But if you want to give your students the opportunity to purchase your other products, um, really we make that really easy. Cool. And I assume with your own dashboard, do you need multiple mem do you need multiple logins if you're buying courses off different people on Podia? I'm just asking as a as a customer. If I was to buy something from Val and then something from Justin, um, when I log in, I would have different logins for each of theirs, I assume. Um, yes, you would. And and the 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 reason for that is is more of a philosophical one. Um our our um our position is that Podia exists uh, not, uh, Podia exists in the background for the creator. So your customers don't ever need to know that you're using Podia. Uh, it's, we're not gonna be a marketplace. We're never going to put your product next to somebody else's product. Uh, and so we're not doing very much to tie those things together for people that are using different Podia creators only because we don't, we don't think that creators want there, you know, we don't think the creators want to share their stage, their platform with other people. Um, we want everything on Podia to be yours, to, for you to own the platform. Um, so we don't have a lot of features that will intermingle um, customers. We may do something that just makes the sign on a little bit easier, but we've shied away from doing that up till now. Nice. No, no, that sounds, that was perfect. Great answer. I just wanted to check because uh, it can actually get mighty confusing. And I think as a learner, I wouldn't necessarily want to come into a dashboard and go, oh my God, there's, there's 15 courses that I've bought. Which one do I start on versus yeah. signing in for the specific person and seeing what I've got under them that I, that I bought. So that makes sense. Definitely. Awesome. Thank you so much. This has been really, really helpful. And um, I'm looking forward to using Podia. We're very much looking forward to having you, Natalie. Um, yeah, and thank you for, uh, for having me on for this. And uh, yeah, if there's ever anything I can answer, uh, don't hesitate to, uh, to let me know. I won't. Thank you. So I really hope you enjoyed that demo. I hope you're like, holy crap, man, Podia is awesome. And you want to check it out. As I said, link below in this video and link below the video. And if you try it out, please let me know. And if you want to use it, 
while creating and pre-selling your own course, then also check out the link below to my Launch Your Damn Course Accelerator that is starting very soon, potentially at the time you're watching this video, or maybe it's closed up for a little bit, but it will be coming back. So at least check out the link below to see what's involved in that, because I want you to take massive action over 60 days figure out your audience, validate your audience, make a fantastic offer, know what you're going to teach, know what impact you're going to have, and pre-sell your course before you've even created it. Because that way, you're being a rock star, you're testing, you're experimenting, you're piloting, without spending tons of money and tons of time trying to create the perfect course without testing it with the very person that you want it to help. So, check out the accelerator below, and I hope that you like Podia, Tell me what you think of it. Let me know in the comments if you're using another platform that you love. I'm all about sharing and caring when it comes to online learning and fantastic tools.